ज्ञानंजन शलाकया चक्षुरुन्मील तस्म श्रीगुरु नम श्रीचैतनोभीष्ट स्थापित ये नूतले स्वयं कदाम ददाति स्वदाति वंदेहम श्रीगुर श्रीयुता पदकमल श्रीगुरुन्वैष्णवांश श्रीप सागर जात सह गण रघुनाथन्वी तम सजीव साधुत सवधूत पिजन सहित कृष्ण चैतन्य दीराधाकृष्णपादान सह गण लिता श्री विशाखान्वीता हे कृष्ण करुणा सिंधु दीनबंधु जगत्पते गोपेश गोपी का राधाकांत नमस्तुते तप्त कांचन गौरांगी राधे वृंदवनेश्वरी वृषभानुसुते देवी प्रणमा हरि प्रिय 
वाचाकूप्य कृपा सिंधु भतिता पावनेभ्यो वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम जय श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिवासादिगौरभक्तवृंद हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 रामा हरे रामा राम रामा हरे हरे नमो विष्णुपादाय कृष्णा पृष्ठा भूतले श्रीमते भक्ति वेदात स्वामी नामिने नमस्ते सारस्वते देव गौरवाणी प्रचारिणे निर्विशेष शून्यवादी पाश्चात्यदेशिणे Hare Krishna. So from today, the most auspicious month of Purushottam Mass is beginning. Hoy empieza el día más auspicioso que es el Purushottam Mass. This Purushottam. This Purushottam Mass is known by different names. Este Purushottam Mass o el mes de Purushottam es conocido por diferentes nombres. Es Adhik Mass. Como adik mas means extra month. Significa mes extra, extra. Or mal mas. Or mal mas. That is the contaminated month. Contaminated, contaminated. Contaminated. Yeah. This is mes contaminado. Actually, uh, in our Vedic calendar. In in realidad, in nuestro Vedic Vedic calendar. Vedic in nuestro calendario vedico. The calculation by the lunar months. La, los cálculos por el mes de eh, regidor. So it falls eleven days short of by the calculation of the solar months. Entonces eh, hay una son once días eh, que faltan para que complete el like, mes. Uh, a lunar year is eleven days shorter. By eleven uh, days shorter to solar year. Entonces, es, es un, este mes tiene once días. Falta once días ¿no? para nuestro calendario solar. So once in three years, this uh, around twenty nine days are accumulated. Entonces, twenty uh, twenty nine days. Entonces son veintiún días. Que se... So for all the twelve months, they are presiding deities. Para todos los doce eh, meses tenemos eh, deidades para cada mes. Like for the Kartik month, the presiding deity is Damodar. Por ejemplo, para el mes de Kartik, eh, la la deidad regente es eh, Damodar. Yeah. Damodar. Like daily we put ten tilaks on our body. Om Keshwaya Namah Narayana Namah Madhvaya Namah. Es como cuando nos ponemos eh, los doce tilaks en nuestro cuerpo. So similarly, these twelve uh, names of Vishnu, twelve Vishnus are the presiding deities of twelve months. Entonces, estos doce nombres de Vishnu son las deidades residentes para los doce meses. But once in three years, this extra month comes. Pero cada tres años eh, entra este mes extra. It has no presiding deity. Y no tiene una deidad regente. When there is no presiding deity, all the people who follow karma can't. Entonces, como no hay una eh, deidad regente, todo el mundo si, sigue el karma kanda. They started considering it as a mal mass, very contaminated mass. Entonces, esto es llamado el mes más contaminado. So, no pious activity is to be performed during this month, as per the karma kanda. Entonces, ninguna actividad piadosa se hace en este mes. And everyone started rejecting this month. Y todo el mundo rechaza este mes. So this month got very, very sad, very morose. Entonces este mes es muy triste, muy, muy caído. What is my fault? ¿Qué cosa es mi defecto? ¿Cuál es mi defecto? Lunar month is eleven days shorter. Lunar year is eleven days shorter than solar years. Once in three years I come and everyone rejects me. 
Entonces, eh, el mes lunar tiene menos de 11 días, y el mes solar también tiene, tiene menos de 11 días. So he went to Lord Vishnu. Entonces, eh, este mes fue al donde el Señor Vishnu. Please do something for me. Por favor, haz algo por, por mí. Lord Vishnu said, yes, this is a very typical problem. Sí, sí, dice, está bien, ¿cuál es el problema? So Lord Vishnu took him to Lord Krishna in Goloka. Entonces el señor Vishnu lo llevó a Krishna en Goloka. Krishna heard him very peacefully. <coughs> Entonces eh, Krishna heard him. Lo oyó muy, muy, este, muy atento. Krishna said, don't worry. Krishna le dijo, no te preocupes. You don't have any name. Tú no tienes ningún nombre. You don't have any presiding deity. Tú no tienes ninguna deidad regente. So I will give my name to you. Te voy a dar mi nombre. Aquí. From now on, you'll be known as Purushottam Mas. Desde ahora tú te vas a llamar el mes de Purushottam. And all my divine qualities will reside in you. Y todas mis cualidades divinas van a residir en ti. This month will have my extra potency, extra blessings, extra mercy. Entonces este mes, este mes va a tener una, una potencia extra, una misericordia extra. So that is also the reason why this month is called extra month. Por eso que este mes se le llama el mes extra, extra. It is said whatever spiritual activities we perform during this month. Se dice que cualquier actividad espiritual que realizas en este mes. It gives million times more results. Da un millón de veces más de resultado. This month is very very dear to the Supreme Lord Krishna. Este mes es muy muy querido al Señor Krishna. Normally, the Kartik, in the Kartik month, whatever spiritual activity we perform, it gives us thousand times more results than the same activity we perform on a normal day. But it is said, in the Purushottam mass, if we perform the same activities, it gives us thousand times more results that we get in the month of Kartik. Pero en el mes de Purushottam, si tú haces alguna actividad, te va a dar diez mil veces más. Therefore, any practicing devotee, entonces cualquier devoto que practica, who is serious about his goal of life, es muy serio acerca de esta meta de la vida, will make the best use of this opportunity. Él toma lo mejor de los, en esta oportunidad. Although by Shila Prabhupada's mercy, a good practicing devotee, a good practicing devotee, daily performs good sadhana. But during this month, if you can do something extra, by quantity as well as quality, in quantity as well as quality, tanto en cantidad como en calidad. So we'll be able to please Krishna. Seremos capaz de complacer a Krishna. We'll have a special mercy. Tenemos, tendremos una misericordia especial. And that's, that's what we all want. Y todo eso es lo que nosotros queremos. As such in spiritual life, en tal, espíritu, en tal vida espiritual, it's very important to keep on taking vows. Es muy importante mantener nuestros votos. If you take vows, nosotros tomamos votos. It increases our determination. It increases our, our determination. It incrementa nuestra determinación. And by taking vows, y por tomar votos, we can develop good habits. Podemos desarrollar buenos hábitos. And give up bad habits. Y, y deshacernos de los malos hábitos. In the modern scientist circles also, en nuestra modern, science. modern scientists, they also, nuestros científicos modernos, they say if you perform an activity for 21 days, si, dicen que si nosotros uh, realizamos alguna actividad por 21 días, it becomes a habit. Se convierte en un hábito. So we have this month. Entonces tenemos este mes. Starting from today. Empezando desde hoy. 18 July. Eh, 18th July. El 18 de julio. To 16th August. 
hasta el 16 de agosto. So we have around 29 days. Hasta tenemos 29 días. So if we start some good new habits, entonces si empezamos algún buen hábito, good new spiritual activities, una nueva actividad espiritual, it can become a habit. Se va a volver un hábito. And we may continue after the Purushottamas is over. Y así lo vamos a continuar después de que termine el mes de Purushottamas. So five main things are recommended in this month. Five main things are recommended in this month. Cinco cosas nuevas se recomienda para este mes. One is, uh, the five main things, snan. First is snan, taking bath. La primera es snan, es decir, tomar baño. It is recommended that in this month one should take bath before sunrise. Entonces se recomienda que en este mes uno se bañe antes de la salida del sol. So devotees who attend Mangalati normally take bath before sunrise. Entonces los, los devotos para ir al Mangalati se bañan antes de que salga el sol. But better, so it will be better in this month. Pero en este mes. We don't miss this nap, this bath, taking bath before sunrise. Debemos, no debemos perdernos este baño antes de la salida del sol. And it is also recommended that we should take bath in holy rivers. También se recomienda que uno se bañe en los ríos sagrados. En los holy kunds, ponds. En los, en los lagos sagrados. Now those who are not staying in India. Those who are not staying in India. Para aquellos que no, no están en la India. They can meditate upon the holy ponds and holy rivers. Pueden meditar en los ríos, en los, en los ríos sagrados, en los, en los lagos sagrados. While taking bath. Mientras se bañan. Or we can chant the name of Ganga, Yavna. O pueden cantar los nombres de Yavna. And take bath. Y, y bañarse. Or sprinkle some water of Ganga or Yavna or Radha Kund over us. That way we should take snan, bath. Así tomamos snan, el baño. Second activity recommended is japa. Después la otra actividad que se recomienda es la japa. Although we chant daily, si nosotros cantamos diariamente, during this month, durante este mes, we can increase our chanting. Podemos incrementar nuestro canto. By four rounds, eight rounds, ten rounds, whatever we, we can do, we should do. And we can also take some vows to complete our 16 rounds de completar nuestras 16 rondas. as early as possible. Uh, lo más temprano que podamos. Let's say before 7 a.m., before 8 a.m., like whatever we can do. Antes de las 7, antes de las 8, lo que podamos hacer. O some devotees take the vow. O algunos devotos toman el voto. Unless we complete our 16 rounds. A menos que uno complete sus 16 rondas. We will not honor breakfast. No, no, no tomamos desayuno. That way we develop a good habit. De esa forma desarrollamos un buen hábito. And those who are not chanting. Para aquellos que no cantan. They can take vow to at least chant daily during Purushottamas. Por lo menos eh, pueden hacer un voto de cantar diariamente durante el mes de Purushottamas. So first is bathing, second is japa, third is dan. Entonces el, Charity. el primero es baño, el segundo es japa y el, y el tercero es dan. Da, charity. Charity. Ah, el tercero es caridad. So in this month we should try to give as much charity as possible. En este mes debemos tratar eh, la mayor caridad que podamos. In Bhagavad Gita it is recommended. En el Bhagavad Gita se recomienda. Charity should be given. En la caridad se debe de dar. For the propagation of Krishna consciousness. Para la propagación de la conciencia de Krishna. Yeah. So we can give charity to the temples. Entonces, podemos dar caridad a los templos. For, for uh, expanding the preaching. Para expandir la predica or for uh, improving the duty worship standards o para mejorar el estándar de la adoración de la deidad or uh, feeding devotees o para dar de comer a los devotos or constructing temples o construir templos so that way we should give charity during this month 
Entonces, así se puede hacer caridad durante este, este mes. Then, fourth is deep. El cuarto es deep. Offering lamps. No, el cuarto es ofer, ofrecer lámparas. Like in Kartik Mass, we offer lamps. Como en el mes de Kartik, nosotros ofrecemos lámparas. Similarly, in this month also. También en este mes. We can offer ghee lamps to the Lord. Podemos ofrecer lámparas de ghee al Señor. Or we can increase our deity worship. O podemos incrementar nuestra adoración a la deidad. And fifth is yagya. Y el quinto es yagya. So the best yagya recommended for kali yuga is. Entonces el mejor yagya que se recomienda para kali yuga es. Nam sankirtan. El nam sankirtan. So all these five items. Entonces todos estos cinco artículos. Snan, jab. Snan, jab. Dan. Dan. Deep. Deep. Yagya. Yagya. Normally, uh, a good sadhak is always doing these activities. The good, a good sadhak. Un buen sadhak es, hace siempre estas actividades. But we can increase it. Pero podemos incrementar más. And intensify it. Y intensificarlas. During the Pushwata Mass. Durante el mes de Pushwatam. Also, it is recommended y se that in this month en este mes, we should observe complete celibacy. Podemos, eh, una if, if possible, sleep on floor. Si es posible, sobre el piso. Eat one time a day. Comer una vez al día. Of course, not compromising on health. Claro, pues no, no hay que la salud. The essence is pero la esencia es to increase the spiritual activities as much as possible. Incrementar las actividades espirituales tan, tan, eh, lo más que sea posible. So that we can receive maximum benefit. Para que podamos recibir un beneficio máximo. So that we can receive, we can attract maximum mercy of the Lord. Para que podamos obtener la misericordia máxima del Señor. Also it is recommended también se recomienda that in this month en este mes we can recite podemos recitar certain prayers certain prayers oraciones like Jagannath Ashtakam como el, el, el Jagannath Ashtakam Lord Jagannath is also known as Purushottam Jagannath también se conoce se le conoce como Purushottam and Jagannath Puri is known as Purushottam Kshetra Jagannath Puri se conoce como Purushottam Kshetra So we should chant Jagannath Ashtakam. Entonces debemos cantar Jagannath Ashtakam. Or we can also chant Chora Agarne Ashtakam. Chora Agarne Ashtakam. Agarne Ashtakam. Chora Agarne Ashtakam. Different and we should also recite. También podemos recitar. Daily we can recite 15th chapter of Bhagavad Gita. Diariamente recitamos el capítulo 15th, el, el, el capítulo 15 de Bhagavad Gita. Purushottam Yoga. El Yoga de Purushottam. Yeah. And we should, we should read more and more Shimad Bhagavatam. Y Daily we should read, read Bhagavatam. Diariamente leer más el Bhagavatam. And Bhagavad Gita. Y Bhagavad Gita. And certain activities, y some? certain activities we should not do. Some acti activities ah, we should not do. Y algunas actividades no se deberían hacer. During this month, durante este mes, we should try to avoid debemos evitar criticizing devotees. Criticar a los devotees. Okay. We should try to avoid debemos evitar doing pajalpa. Hacer uh, pajalpa. Useless talks. Uh, conversaciones que son inútiles. And not to waste time. Y no perder el tiempo. Too much time. No, no perder mucho tiempo. Surfing on social media, everything, all those things. Eh, navegar por uh, medios sociales. La idea es, you see, Lord Krishna is very, very merciful. La idea es que el Señor Krishna es muy misericordioso. He, you know, launches such schemes. He launches such schemes of Schemes of receiving extra mercy. 
like like in a sales store they have a, this launches on sale you know products on sale cheaper price como si estuviera haciendo ofertas similarly lord krishna de manera similar al señor krishna during purushottam mass during purushottam sees now extra mercy take free free bhakti free <laughs> Take more mercy. So, so we should be very, very eager to receive this extra mercy. If you are not showing any eagerness, that shows we are not so much serious in our spiritual life. Entonces él va a ver que no somos muy serios en nuestra vida espiritual. And Lord Krishna himself is promising. Pero el Señor Krishna mismo nos promete. If you perform these activities during this month. Que si realizas estas actividades durante este mes. I will give extra mercy. Eh, te voy a dar una misericordia extra. So any serious sadhaka. Entonces cualquier sadhaka serio. Should take it very seriously. Lo debe tomar muy seriamente. So, uh, whatever is possible as per our capacity, as per our situation, we should take some vows, something extra during this month. Okay? So, because the Purushottam Mass is starting today, entonces, debido a que el mes de Purushottam empieza hoy día, so we'll chant, we'll start 15 chapter of Bhagavad Gita. Entonces, vamos a empezar con el quinto capítulo, ya todo en el quinceavo capítulo de Bhagavad Gita. So we'll recite the first verse. Vamos a recitar el primer verso. Urdva mulam adhashakha Urdva mulam adhashakha Ashwatham prahu abhyayam Ashwatham prahu abhyayam Chandasi yasya paranani Chandasi yasya paranami Yastam veda sa veda vid Yastam veda sa veda vid You can recite Urdva mula dhamma dhashankam Urdva mula madhashaka Ashvatam prahu abhyatam Ashvatam prahu abhyayam Chandasi Chandasi Yasya Parnami Chandasi Yasya Parnani Yastam Veda Satve David Yastam Veda Save David Urdva Mula Nada Shankam Urdva Mula Dhashakam Ashwatam Prahur Abhyayam La traducción Word by word? No. no. You read the, uh, the translation of first four verses. Oh. So we'll read the translation of first four verses and we'll try to discuss them in summary. Entonces, la traducción es, la suprema personalidad de Dios dijo, se dice que hay un árbol baniano imperecedero que tiene sus, ra sus raíces hacia arriba y sus ramas hacia abajo y cuyas hojas son los himnos médicos. Aquel que conoce ese árbol es el conocedor de los Vedas. Verso número 2. El verso número 2. <coughs> Traducción. Las ramas de ese árbol se extienden hacia abajo y hacia arriba alimentadas por las tres modalidades de la naturaleza material. Las ramitas son los objetos de los sentidos. Ese árbol también tiene raíces que van hacia abajo y estas, y estas están vinculadas con las acciones fruitivas de la sociedad humana. Versos 3 y 4. La verdadera forma de ese árbol no se puede percibir en este mundo. Nadie puede entender dónde termina, dónde comienza, ni dónde está su base. Pero de un modo decidido, uno debe cortar con el arma del desapego ese árbol fuertemente enraizado. 
Después, uno debe buscar aquel lugar del cual, una vez que se ha ido a él, nunca se regresa, y entregarse ahí a esa suprema personalidad de Dios, a partir de quien todo comenzó y todo se ha extendido desde tiempo inmemorial. Thank you. The first one verse is, first four verses, Lord Krishna is describing Entonces, about this material world. Entonces estos versos describen, el Señor Krishna está describiendo este mundo material. And Krishna is comparing the material existence. Krishna is comparing. Comparing. Com comparing. comparing. Ah, este, Krishna está comparando esta existencia material. To a banyan tree. A un árbol baniano. You see, uh, the spiritual subject matters. Ustedes ven en los... Eh, de los temas espirituales cannot be understood by material mind and intelligence no puede ser comprendido por una inteligencia material so to make us understand pues para poder entender krishna gives analogy krishna nos da una analogía so here he is giving an analogy pues aquí está dando esa analogía very interesting analogy una analogía muy interesante of a banyan tree de un árbol baniano, whose roots are upward, que los, las raíces están hacia arriba, and branches are down, y las ramas están hacia abajo. How is it possible? ¿Cómo es eso posible? Urdhva mulam adhashaka. Urdhva means up. Urdhva means eh, quiere decir arriba. Mulam means root. Mula significa raíces. Root is upward. Las raíces están arriba. Adha means down. Shaka means branches. Shaka significa ramas. So the root is up, branches are down. And this banyan tree is abhyayam. Abhyayam means imperishable. And it is said. Chandasiyasya Parnani Yastam Veda Sarveda with and its leaves are what? Vedic hymns. Vedic mantras are his leaves. And one who knows this tree completely is the knower of the Vedas. So, very interesting analogy. Es una analogía muy interesante. So normally where do we find such kind of a tree whose roots are upward and branches are down? Entonces, ¿dónde encontramos ese tipo de árbol que sus raíces están para arriba y sus ramas para abajo? Any idea? ¿Alguna idea? Where we can find such tree? ¿Dónde encontramos ese árbol? Hmm? Bhagavad Gita, only in Bhagavad Gita. <laughs> in the spiritual world. Uh, spiritual world, no, spiritual trees will be there. <laughs> yeah. So normally the roots are upward, branches are down. Normally in a tree, a root is down, branches are up. Normalmente las ramas están para abajo y las ramas están para abajo. So, so this upside down can happen only in a reflection. Entonces, si están para abajo todo, solamente se puede ver en un reflejo. So just imagine a tree on the bank of a river. Entonces, imagínense ese árbol a la orilla del río. So when the tree is reflected in the river, cuando el árbol se refleja en el río, it branches will appear down and its 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 root will appear uh, up and branches will appear down upside down so my lord krishna is saying this material existence is like an upside down tree that means it's in reflection it's not a reality. Es, es, no es la realidad. Reality is upward. La, la spiritual realidad, sky. La realidad está para arriba. So real, real love, real relationships, real friendship exists in spiritual world. 
Entonces, el amor real, la amistad real, existe solo en el mundo espiritual. And in the material world, what we perceive as love, friendship, relationship are only reflection. Y en el mundo material lo que percibimos como amor, amistad y revelación es solamente un reflejo. If you have a, a mango tree, si tenemos un árbol de mango, and you are seeing the reflection of mango in the river, y vemos el reflejo del árbol en el río, man jumps in the river, el hombre se tira al río. Oh, I'll get some mangoes there. Voy a agarrar unos mangos ahí. He'll keep on searching. He'll just say, I'll just get it. This is reflecting. I'll get it. <laughs> tries it. He tries it. Goes to cash and there's no mango. Again he comes out and sees, hey, mango is there. Again he jumps. Again he tries. He's not getting. This is what is our material life. We feel, if I get this, this is there, this, this happiness is there, right there. If I get it, I'll be happy. It's only a reflection. Like, you know, in, in Lima, you go to so many malls are there, shopping malls. So all these shopping malls, they sell ready-made clothes. So on the outside of their ready-made clothes, for you know, for for advertisement, they put men and queens. You know, men and queens. So for promotional, the clothes that they sell there, they are given to some mannequins. Handsome, handsome men, beautiful women. And they dress them very nicely. If I see them, I get attracted to a man or a woman. <laughs> I, I start embracing that person, that man and queen. Oh, what a beautiful man. So initially, I may get some enjoyment. Oh, I'm embracing. Inicialmente podemos tener algún algún disfrute, ¿no? Estoy abrazando. There's no reality. Pero no es la realidad. No, it's just a reflection. Es solo un reflejo. This is the material world. Este es el mundo material. So, Lord, why Lord Krishna is giving this analogy? Entonces, cuando el Señor Krishna da esta analogía, he wants us to develop detachment. Él quiere que desarrollemos desapego. Detachment from this material world. Desapego de este mundo material. And attachment for the Supreme Lord. Y apego por el Señor Supremo. As long as we are attached to this material world. Mientras estemos apegados a este mundo material. We won't get impetus. We won't be eager to progress in spiritual life. No vamos a estar, uh, no vamos a anhelar la vida espiritual. We'll always be hopeful. Nosotros vamos, siempre vamos a tener esperanza. Of finding love and happiness in this material world. De encontrar el amor y felicidad en este mundo material. So Lord is in such a graphic example. Entonces el Señor nos da un ejemplo tan gráfico. It's only a reflection. Solo es un reflejo. Now for a reflection, for a re object to be reflected. Entonces para que el objeto se refleje. We need a reflecting media. Tenemos que tener un medio para que para que se refleje. Like the tree is being reflected on the river. Como el, rey, como el árbol se refleja en el río. So the spiritual world is reflected in the material world. Entonces el, espíritu, el mundo espiritual se refleja a, como el mundo material. The reflecting media is desire. El medio para que se refleje es el deseo. Because we desire to enjoy separately from the Lord. Porque nosotros queremos disfrutar separados de Dios. This material existence is there. Esta existencia material existe. And this material existence is imperishable. Y esta existencia material es, es imperecedera. It will not end. Nunca terminará. As long as Mientras we are keeping this desire mantengamos estos deseos. of enjoying separately from the Lord. De disfrutar separados. We'll be going from one branch to the other branch. 
Iremos de una, de una rama a otra. One species to other species. De, especie, de una especie a otra. One planet to other planet. De un planeta a otro. And keep on rotating. Y vamos a seguir rotando así. So this is, in the second verse, Lord is saying, in the second verse, the Lord is saying, Now, normally a tree, if it's the tree is to be nourished, it has to be watered. Like Lord Chaitanya says, in Chaitanya Chaitanya when we receive Bhakti Lata Beach, Cuando recibimos el Bhakti Lata Beach, it has to be cultivated. It has to be cultivated. Tiene que ser cultivado. Watered. Regado. By Shravan Kirtan. Por el Shravan Kirtan. Similarly, this tree of material existence. Entonces, similarmente, este árbol de la existencia is, material is watered. Su el agua. By three modes of nature. Es regado por las tres modalidades de la naturaleza. So, it's three, it's due to these three modes of nature. They are nourishing this tree. And this tree is so complicated. Y este árbol es tan like from the branches also, some branches are also coming down. And the branches are also looking like roots. Y las ramas If you have seen any banyan tree, Si ustedes han visto algún árbol baniano, like there's a tree a root, the tree is coming up, and from the branches also some branches are coming down. Which is very com difficult to understand. Entonces es muy difícil de comprender. Which is branch and which is the root? ¿Cuál es la raíz y cuál es la rama? From where the tree is beginning. Where the tree is beginning, de donde, ¿cómo empieza el árbol? and where the tree is ending, y cómo, de donde termina, a donde termina el árbol. very, very difficult. Muy difícil. So, that shows that eternally conditioned soul, Entonces, la, la, el alma eterno, eternamente. if we remain interested in enjoying this material world, our material existence is nuestra existencia material es will remain eternal. Eh, eterna, va a ser eterna. It's very, very complicated. Es muy complicado. Now, if I try to understand this tree, Entonces, si yo trato de comprender este árbol, it's impossible. No es posible. And this tree looks beautiful by its green leaves. Entonces, este árbol muy por sus hojas and these leaves are what? Vedic hymns, Vedic mantras. Y estas, eh, hojas son los, los, los médicos, so the Vedic, Vedic mantras promise us los mantras nos you perform this yagya, you perform this karmakand activity. Si haces este yagya, haces este you will get wealth, you will get good wife, you will get good son. Or you will go to heaven and enjoy. So we get entangled. So we get bewildered by these false promises. So that's why it is said. One who knows a complete tree, Aquel que conoce todo el árbol completo, he knows the Vedas. Él conoce los Vedas. It's not said, no se dice, one who knows the Vedic mantra, que si uno conoce el mantra védico, he knows the Vedas. Él sabe los Vedas. Because in second chapter of Bhagavad Gita also, in the capítulo de Bhagavad, Bhagavad Gita, Bhagavad Gita, Krishna has said, Krishna dice, Mostly these Vedas deal with three modes of material nature. So Arjuna go beyond these three modes. 
So if we may, if we get attracted to only Vedic hymns, we are not Ved with, we are not understood the Vedas. Because the purpose of understanding the Veda is is to understand Krishna, to know Krishna. That's why it is very much important to know this material existence. To know this material, it's very important. But if we try to understand this complicated banyan tree, from where the root is coming, where the branch is coming up, down, so much complicated. And our acharya explains the main root is Brahma Lok. From Brahmaji, it is coming down. Main root. Main root is from Brahma's Lok, Satya Lok. And the upper branches are upper planets. Lower branches are the lower planets. And sometimes from the upper branches are coming down and they are appearing as roots. So, understanding this tree is not impossible. What to do? Krishna is saying, Asanga Shastena Dridena Chitva, with the weapon of renunciation, cut this tree with determination. With the weapon of detachment, weapon of detachment. Cut this tree. No point in understanding this tree. No sentido de entender este árbol. Just cut it with detachment. And only detachment is not the goal of life. After detaching, what should we do? The fourth was, then we should go to the Supreme Lord, take his shelter, and going there, no one will come back. So this is very important. So to develop detachment, we need association of devotees. And when we, in the association of devotees, we discuss scriptures, then we develop detachment. And we also develop attachment for the Lord. And in association of devotees only, we come to know this material world is only a perverted reflection. Without the association of devotees, this material world with its glamour, pomp and show, false promises of happiness, so we get illusioned, we get bewildered, and then we get entrapped, birth after birth. Thus, we are just saying, yeah, this, is sweet. this fruit will be sweet, this fruit will be sweet. Jumping from one branch to other branch. But no happiness. Okay. So that's why association of devotees and discussion of scripture is so important so that we develop detachment and then we develop attachment for the Lord.
Entonces, la asociación con los devotos es tan importante para desarrollar, para desapegarnos de las, de las cosas materiales y apegarnos al Señor, a Dios. That's why this chapter is called Purushottam Yoga. Por eso que este capítulo se le llama el Yoga de Purushottam. Linking with Lord Purushottam. Relacionado con el Señor Purushottam. And in Purushottam Mas, y este mes de Purushottam, we should meditate on this 15th chapter. Tenemos que meditar en este 15 capítulo. Each and every, this 15th chapter is the shortest chapter in Bhagavad Gita, 20 verses only. Este es el capítulo más corto, solo tiene 21 versos. But each and every verse is very, very important. Pero cada uno de los versos es muy importante. And Prabhupada has very nicely elaborated. Y Prabhupada lo ha elaborado muy, muy bonito. So let's make full use of this Purushottam Mas. Debemos eh, observar este, este mes de Purushottam completamente. And attract the mercy of the Lord. Y obtener la misericordia del Señor. Hare Krishna. Questions? ¿Alguna pregunta? Uh, ¿Cómo reconocer eh, que uno se está desapegando y, y, y no llevarlo como si fuera un, un no un vínculo total? Y a veces uno se desapega, pero a veces uno confunde la responsabilidad con el desapego. Eh, ¿cómo, ¿Cómo uno puede man debe manejar eso? ¿Cómo se, se, se sienta? Responsibilities and you feel attached to those responsibilities, so you just let go. Very intelligent question. <laughs> Sometimes, in the name of detachment, veces en el nombre del desapego, we tend to become irresponsible. Tenemos la tendencia de ser irresponsables. And sometimes, in the name of being responsible, y a veces en el nombre de la responsabilidad we become attached. Nos, nos apegamos. So we have to be very, very careful. Entonces tenemos que ser muy cuidadosos. So responsible means Entonces, eh, ser responsable significa we'll do nice planning. Que, hacemos, que planeamos todo muy bien. We make all arrangements. Que hacemos todos los arreglos. Give our best efforts. Eh, ponemos nuestro mejor esfuerzo. But for the result For the result, we are completely dependent. Pero por el resultado, nosotros somos, estamos dependiendo completamente. Because the result is not in my hand. Porque no está en nuestras manos. All circumstances, situations are not in my hand. Eh, las circunstancias y situaciones no están en, mi, en mis manos. Other peoples are not under my control. <laughs> y las, las demás personas no están bajo mi control. Their mind, I, I cannot control their minds. No, no puedo controlar sus mentes. I cannot control their responses. No, no puedo controlar sus respuestas. I can only try to inspire them. Solo puedo tratar de inspirar. So that way I take responsibility. Esa es la idea de la responsabilidad. But remain detached from the results. Y pero permanecer desapegado de los resultados. If results are not coming as per my desire. Si los resultados no vienen como no se no parecen como yo deseo. If I'm really responsible, si yo soy realmente responsable, I'll again keep on continuing my a, efforts. Voy a seguir continuando. I won't get depressed, no me voy a deprimir, frustrated, o frustrar, start blaming people, y, y culpar a la gente. Okay. And being attached means y estar apegado significa, I have to get the result as per my desire. Yo tengo que obtener los resultados como yo deseo. If I'm not getting si no los obtengo, It's all because of this person, this person. So we develop, we'll fight, we'll quarrel, we'll do everything. So that, is, that shows we are just we're too much attached. And when we are attached, sometimes our services may get, we may, the higher authorities may change our services. Higher authorities, higher, higher authorities may change our services. So sometimes we get attached to services also. So we should be attached to the attitude of serving, not to the service itself. 
Entonces debemos estar apegados a la actitud de servicio y no al servicio en sí mismo. These are very subtle things. Son cosas bien sutiles. Is that clear? Claro. And if you are irresponsible, si, si tú eres irresponsable, I'm trying to say no, I'm very detached. Y decir no, no, yo estoy bien desapegado. I won't plan anything. I won't make any effort. Oh, Krishna will take care. I'm detached. No, that's not good. No voy a planear nada. No voy a hacer nada. Krishna se hace cargo. No voy a, no voy a ser responsable. So, Prabhupada is perfect example. Si la Prabhupada es el ejemplo perfecto. While Prabhupada was in India, Radha Damodar Temple. Cuando Prabhupada estaba en la India en el templo de Radha Damodar. He had the complete blueprint of International League of Devotees. Was. International League of Devotees, complete blueprint was there. The blueprint, complete, he had complete plan how he'll expand his movement. But the things were not materializing. He did not give up. He kept on trying. Like this. Y bueno, el hecho de seguir intentando no sería pegarse a un resultado que no es. But the fact that you, you keep trying is, doesn't mean that you, you are attached. No. Yeah. If you are trying, that doesn't mean we are attached. As long as our efforts are sanctioned by higher authorities. Si nosotros eh, seguimos continuando, puede, puede que eso sea apego para. Higher authorities are sanctioning our efforts. Pero las autoridades que están más arriba van a, van a estar pendientes de nuestras. Prabhupada was making efforts because his guru had ordered him. Eh, eh, Prabhupada eh, continuó esforzándose porque su guru le había eh, ordenado eso. But our higher authority is saying something else and we are trying to do something else, that means show attachment. Because uh, if you, your spiritual master asks you to do one service, you put, you are determined to do the service. And then, and then you, you, you know, get hold of this of this service because of this motivation no? that give you, that the spiritual master give you. Entonces, a veces el entorno puede pensar, oye, está pegado, está pegado a ese servicio. So, other people might think, oh, he's attached to his service. Entonces, ¿cómo, cómo, cómo eh, lidiar esa situación? Eh, porque se cometen a veces nuestras acciones. How to deal with that situation because sometimes you get you know some conflict with other yeah. people. So I am following my spiritual master's instructions, but other people around me are saying, see, he's too much attached. Okay. No problem. No problem. It's good that some people are criticizing us. <laughs> okay, because I should also be very careful that I have a tendency to get attached. We all have this tendency. We should be honest with ourselves. So if other people are criticizing, we should be thoughtful. Maybe I am attached. Okay, so what should I do? Should I give up my service? 
No, I can go back to spiritual master. No, Whatever the higher authorities in whom we have trust and we have good relations and honestly reveal them the situation. So there can be a mixture. Although I may be following Guru's orders and I may be donning some other attachments also. So I should be careful. So we should not be getting too much discouraged by the criticism. And at the same time, at the same time, we should not completely ignore the criticism. Eh? So we are all useless. No, we must ignore completely the criticism or the criticism. Getting the point? Because if we say these are all envious people, they just keep on criticizing. So, you know, I may go off the track. And if I get too much discouraged by their criticism, then I may <laughs> lose the service. That's also not good. So that's why in his con society, Srila Prabhupada has made this system. Everyone is being checked. <laughs> Sometimes this checking becomes too much. <laughs> But we should not feel discouraged. No problem. <laughs> they are trying to polish me. No problem. <laughs> but we should have some higher authorities with whom we can reveal our heart. If they are satisfied, no problem. And if they give feedback, we should accept. Give some feedback, we should accept. That's why we keep balance. Things are in a balanced situation. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Pero en solicitamos los mil veces, los mil veces, un millón de veces, o necesitas esta, qué cantidad de veces, un millón, es lo que pedí. Cuando yo estaba diciendo que Kartik y Purushitam eran muy importantes. Uh, which one was 1,000 times? Yeah. You, you get 1,000 times more benefit? Yeah. In Kartik is 1,000 times more than a normal day. Uh, yeah. In Kartika, nosotros obtenemos mil veces más beneficio en, en, en un día normal. And Purushota Mas, 1,000 better than Kartik. 1,000? 1,000 better than Kartik. Purushota Mas. So 10,000. 1,000. And Kartik is 1,000. Kartik is 1,000. Whatever we do in Kartik is 1,000 better than the normal day. Purushottam mass, what we do is 1,000 better than Kartik. Oh, okay. In Kartik, we have 1,000 more benefits. 
pero en el mes de Purushottam tenemos, tenemos mil veces más eh, las bendiciones de Kapi. O sea, es mil por mil. Mil por mil. Mil veces multiplicado por mil. Hare Krishna. हम अभी ज्वाइन कर रहे हैं बस में क्लास में था दो तीन यस तो यस इस 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 So, I mean, it 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 it, <laughs> it is just a way to glorify. It's not that exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you cannot. It's not a way to glorify. Okay, let's stop okay. here. Paramos. Yes. Thank you very much. भगवदगीता की पुरुषोत्तम मास की जगत गुरु श्रीला प्रभुपाद की गोप्य मनंद